We're on the ferry, leaving Coopville, back there about uh, two miles ago where that little fog cloud is there. That's about where we were, just to the right of that. Kind of a cloudy day in the Puget Sound area. Woke up to some fog or something, jump or some seaweed out there. Guess there's just some birds on there. Anyway, this is looking back at Woodby Island at the Coopville Coopville Ferry Terminal. We're looking at the sandy, undulating shoreline of Woodby Island on the south side. Beautiful fresh air out here and just breathing well with uh, lots of oxygen. We're looking towards uh, EB Landing, uh, Natural Farmland Preserve there, 12,000 acres. Beautiful area. The island's about 35, well, about 45 miles long, I think, and uh, two miles to 10 miles wide or 15 miles wide, approximately. We're on the way to uh, Port Townsend, Washington. Historic Port Townsend is actually uh, so cool for me. It's, uh, it's real representative of the old world history. Uh, much older than what the buildings say on the side. world buildings that we're seeing around the world with a similar architecture. I try to get some good video and photos of that today. Looks like we're coming around to a point over there. There's a state park there uh, in, in Port Townsend, in Port Flagler, I believe it is. And there are some historic old forts here. I'm not sure if there's any star forts, but I wouldn't doubt it. Uh, quite a few forts. So, going into kind of a fog bank over there in Port Townsend. Please watch the next video and uh, like and subscribe if you want to see more of Seattle area sights and wonders. This history comes alive. Pretty exciting to live here and discover these things just in the last few months or years. These old, old world buildings all over in some of these older towns and stuff. Uh, really, really awesome. Thanks for watching.